Good evening, welcome to CBS and Baltimore Live Com. Well, a beautiful evening right now, down to 71, upper 60s to the north of us, only 59 degrees in Oakland right now. Ocean City at 73, and Annapolis, the hot spot there at 76. By the bay, it is certainly warmer, so that'll be warmer overnight tonight. Away from the area tonight, away from the bay, we'll be back in the 50s overnight tonight. Really pleasant. Still some showers along the lower eastern shore, as you can see, Accomack County, Virginia. Portions of Worcester, Wacomago, still getting some showers. That front kind of stalled out south of us, but still creating some showers. The rest of us, quiet, generally clear skies overnight. You can see that front slow down right there, kind of slowly going off to the east. And that's why we hear those showers down there. The rest of the state, pretty much clear skies. Now, there will be a slight increase in clouds by tomorrow night. There could be a brief sprinkle of shower in western sections as that front approaches from the west northwest. Midnight tonight, clear skies in the Baltimore region. Then late in the day tomorrow, a few clouds moving in from the west. Could be a shower by six or seven out in far western regions. We might see some cloud cover. Then it clears up. Beautiful day coming up on Friday, Saturday, into the weekend. It looks really, really pleasant. Not anything to really disturb a weather fact. It's going to be kind of cool at night. Lots of places will be in the low to mid 50s and in the city, probably just around the low 60s. So it's a very pleasant weather headed away. Quick look at that is not tropical depression, Harvey, but we'll get to it eventually. <laughs> Hopefully, we'll get to Harvey. There's Harvey right there. Harvey's sitting just to the west of the Yucatan. It does have winds now of 35 miles an hour. However, it is expected to strengthen as it heads directly for the Texas coast. It's going to sit there, unfortunately, for several days. They could see a foot or more of rain over much of central and southern Texas there. There's going to be some massive flooding, unfortunately, for those folks there because there's nothing pushing this storm. Once it gets in that area, it's going to be stuck there for a while. So it'll just keep bringing all this Gulf moisture into Texas. So we'll be watching that depression. It may become even a minimal hurricane just before landfall. It is expected to be a tropical storm in a couple of days, but it could become a hurricane. So Harvey, which died, it was stronger. It collapsed over the land that it's rebuilding now in the very warm Gulf waters there west of the Yucatan, in the Bay of Campeche, actually. North winds 5 to 10 knots, but no advisory in the Bay. The Bay temp around 81 degrees. So tonight, clear, comfortable, 64 by morning. Tomorrow, 81. Delightful, beautiful afternoon. Really nice weather the next five days. Friday, 78, 77, 78, 78. Temperatures running about 5 to 7 degrees below normal for that entire period. It'll feel just like September is supposed to, but here it is still in August. May not see another 90 degree day here for the rest of this month. In fact, I really don't expect it. Have an updated forecast late tonight.